YouTube! Today, I want to talk about something a little bit different. It's not about sex. Whoa, let that sink in for a moment. Okay, I want to talk to you about a shaper thing. About something that will probably be useful to anybody, but especially to shapers. It's an attitude shift. Yes. What we're going to talk about today is shifting your attitude to something more helpful that will make your life more awesome, as usual. Otherwise, I wouldn't be sharing the video in the first place. So what, what I want you to play with is the following. You know how cleaning is usually this giant pile of stuff that you need to somehow get around to when you're dreading it all week or even for weeks or in some cases months you know how there's just these little tasks like cleaning up and tidying up and oh this place is a mess again and it's dirty and it's gross and ew I don't want to do that you know this feeling probably now I have recently learned from somebody very wise that there's a better way to do this there's a better way to go about cleaning and basically making your life more awesome. It's this. You learn a little thing called 15 second game. Uh, every so often, you're just sitting around and you go, okay. For the next 15 seconds, I'm going to improve my room or my house in some way. And then you pick something and then you go one, two, three, go! And then you go, 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 go and do it. And you count 15. You, can, you, you don't want to just spend minutes for no good reason. You count to 15 seconds. And then after that you stop. And then you do something else. You go do uh, go about your day and do other stuff. That's it. That's the whole thing. <laughs> it's not more complicated than this. This is the trick. But it has a lot of cool effects. Because. Um, you're focusing on doing little chunks of things for 15 seconds and anybody can focus for 15 seconds anybody I don't care who you are you can focus for 15 seconds you can have fun you can have this attitude of how can I make my life more awesome and fun for 15 seconds at a time because it's pretty hard to do that for an entire hour <laughs> I get that that's tough. That's not really easy. But for 15 seconds, you could do that. You could treat it as a game and as something cool and awesome that will make your life better. Because it is and it does. So it's very easy. It's very easy to believe in that. It's much harder to believe in that cleaning is awesome for an entire hour. This It's just harder. So 15 seconds and you do that throughout your day. You just every now and then when you have a moment, say you're about to go out the door and you have about two minutes left before you really need to go. Two minutes. That's like eight times 15 seconds. <laughs> I had to count there. Uh, eight times 15 seconds. That's, that's a lot of eight, that's a lot of 15 seconds. 
You can do a lot in two minutes. And suddenly, instead of looking at a thing and going, oh, oh, that's gonna take like an hour to clean. You look at it and go, all right, that's 15 seconds and that's 15 seconds. And I can do that real quick. That's also 15 seconds. And that's ooh, about 10 seconds. So I can do a little bit extra. Uh, <laughs> It works really cool. It works really awesome. And I was a bit skeptical. Of course. Like I am. <laughs> I was a bit skeptical like, but I'll be cleaning all day. I don't want to be cleaning all day. I get it. I was feeling that exact same thing you are. But it didn't happen. I decided, okay, I'm going to try it. Alright, I'm going to try this. And see how it goes. And I've tried it now for... Let's see... About one and a half weeks. And it's amazing. Which is why I'm doing a video on it. Because it's amazing. And I want to share the amazing with you guys. So you can also make your life more awesome. My room... Has never been tidier. My house has never been tidier. My house has never been cleaner. I am getting around to projects that I didn't even realize were in here. Like, apparently I have this giant list of, wow, I need to get around to this someday. Because I'm never lacking for stuff to pick for the next 15 seconds. And sure, um, not everything fits in the 15 seconds. Okay. If you're going to clean the toilet, you need a little bit more than 15 seconds. But just wiping... Um, wiping the, the window... The, uh, come on, words. Mirror. The mirror. <laughs> the mirror in your toilet. Or the mirror in your bathroom. Or uh, taking a shower anyway and just scrubbing the shower while you're at it. Uh, while you're waiting for your shampoo to go into your hair a little bit better. Um, those are easy. Those take literally 15 seconds. Okay, done. Or just do take a few extra seconds when you've just had a drink. You take a few extra seconds to quickly rinse it and put it on the drying rack. And then suddenly you have a clean kitchen again instead of a, a glass sitting there. And if you do this all the time, you always have a clean kitchen. But the, okay, I was explaining... I get sidetracked. I was explaining how it worked for me. So for me, it's been like... Like having a cleaning lady. Except I'm the cleaning lady. Except... It doesn't feel like I'm the cleaning lady. It doesn't feel like I've spent hours and hours and hours cleaning, because I haven't. <laughs> but I have spent time cleaning. I've spent time tidying up, I've spent time sorting stuff. So, it's a lot. I've had cleaning ladies. Unfortunately, not anymore, because uh, I can't afford it right now. But. I've had cleaning ladies. It feels a lot like that. Except better. Because with a cleaning lady, she comes maybe uh, once a week. And then stuff piles up until then. Or it doesn't have to, but it tends to because you're paying her anyway. So you don't really do any cleaning in between, usually. Um, so stuff piles up during the week. And you still have to look at that. And now I don't. And I do things my way. And the cleaning lady doesn't. <laughs> Unless you really, really communicate a lot. And then still, she has her own style. And, and I have my own style. And I have my own preferred products. And she has her own preferred products. And really, you can't make somebody an exact copy of you. Nor should you want to. So, really, there's always going to be differences in how you clean. Logically. 
And so what I found is that having me do all the stuff is much better for me. <laughs> I, I'm much more like, huh, that's nice. That's exactly where I'd expect it to be. <laughs> that's exactly where I would put it because I put it there. <laughs> Right? I don't know. It maybe it doesn't make any sense. But it has really helped me a lot. One and a half weeks? It, and even after two days, I was already raving about it. I have some friends I talk to every day on Skype. And I was, I was raving about it. I was like, wow, my room has never been cleaner. How... How did I not know this before? Why did I tr di why did I not try this before? Doesn't matter. I've tried it now, and it's awesome. And you could have this in your life very easily. Just play a game. Just play a game. The fifteen-second game. And okay. It doesn't matter if it's exactly 15 seconds that you're doing a thing. If you want to finish it, all right. Just make sure you keep holding this joy and this fun. And if you get too much overboard, you will start to lose it. If you spend minutes uh, each time on cleaning stuff and tidying stuff up. On the one hand, it can be awesome because you get more done. On the other hand, um, I found if I let it slip too much and spend some, at some point, 10 minutes on something, like cleaning the whole kitchen instead of just dropping it in, you know, like 15 seconds or maybe a minute or so, cleaning stuff and then go do something else, then I lose it a bit again. Then I lose the excitement and the enthusiasm and the, oh, this is awesome. So I would recommend actually trying to stick to the 15 seconds. Maybe make it a minute max. And then just try to stick to that. And just ch whatever you're trying to do, make it into little chunks of these things that you can actually manage. Like instead of cleaning the whole toilet in one go, um, make it into little chunks. All right, um, uh, for the next 15 seconds, I'm going to put that, that toilet cleaner in it so that it can soak. And then um, a little bit later, when I have some time again, for that 15 seconds, I will take a good scrub brush and I'll just clean all the thing. And you'll find if you're focused and you're doing and you, you can work much faster and much you put much more things into 15 seconds than you think. <laughs> But still, if it's too big, if it's too big a thing, then cut it into chunks and then it works. And then you can keep that enthusiasm, that excitement going. And that's the important part of this uh, thing. But it really, it's not about the doing. And that's weird to say to shapers, but it's not. It's not about the doing. It's about that attitude. It's uh, not about, not even about the attitude I just said of, of being, keeping that excitement going. It's about the attitude of, hey, everything around me is 15 second tasks. Everything that I've been looking up to like a giant mountain for months, it's really just a, a bunch of 15 second, second tasks. And I can at any time, just take 15 seconds and make my life better. At any time, I can take a few seconds and make my life better. Instead of all the time going like, oh, this is, oh, that's awful. Oh, look at, look around. There's so much mess. Where do I even start? Or just looking at the whole world like, you know, this hopeless place of, I can't do anything about it. You son, you make it into this place where you can do everything about it because everything when it comes right down to it is just a bunch of 15 second tasks well really talking to a person how long are you really gonna 
say a sentence for. That's a 15 second task. Just knocking on somebody's door is a 15 second task. <laughs> Going up to somebody and saying, hey, I like your hair. That's a 15 second task. It's probably less actually. So everything in the whole world suddenly becomes doable. That's the that's the secret of this attitude shift that you, you instead of being this whiny, hopeless uh, <laughs> person, you become this, hey, I can fix that. I can do that. I can change that. You suddenly have this different outlook on your world. That it goes way beyond cleaning and tidying up. It goes into this, hey, there's something I don't like, I can fix it. There's something I don't like, I can do something about it. And if it doesn't work in 15 seconds, then maybe it'll work in four times 15 seconds. But everything just becomes this doable, manageable chunk, doable, manageable task. There's nothing too big. So, the point being of this whole video is it's very, very easy to take charge of your life, basically. And to, to try it out, you can, you can start with cleaning and tidying up and seeing how much easier your life gets, how much more fun it is, how much more amazing things are when everything is in the place where you thought it would be. Actually, I, I skipped that part. I should have mentioned that earlier. So one is that you spend 15 seconds every now and then um, on tidying up your room or your space or whatever you want to tackle the kitchen, the bathroom. The other is when you do things, when you tidy up, when you come home, when you take off your clothes, you put things in the, sp in the place where you would first look for them, where you would expect them to be, where if you would have to look for it right now, like say I have a pen and I'm trying to tidy it up. If I would look for a pen right now, where would I look for it first? And you put it there. And then magically, after a while, or log by logical extension, after a while, everything will be in the first place you look. Imagine how much time you've wasted looking for stuff. Maybe sometimes hours when you couldn't find something. It wouldn't happen anymore. It wouldn't because you would have thought about it before putting it away. And you would have put it exactly where you would look for it. So first place you look, it's going to be there. And if you happen to have some kind of weird brain twist going on, maybe it's in the second or the third place, but it's never going to be hours and hours of looking because you're suddenly not, not suddenly a different person. You're the same person. So what makes sense to you now makes sense to you in a week's time or in a month's time, or even in a year's time. If you're like, well, I would look for this in my closet in the hallway. So I'll put it there. Then in, in a month's time, when you're actually looking for the thing, you might, you probably won't remember this, but you will go like, okay, where would I have put this? Where does it make sense that this would be? Then you go look there and bam, there it is right there. That's cool. <laughs> so there's, there's two elements of this, but the most important part, which is why I stressed it so much is this attitude shift. 
this attitude shift to instead of looking at things and going like, oh god it's so hopeless oh so much cleaning <laughs> I don't I can't do that it's so much I don't even want to instead of holding <laughs> holding that attitude you do instead hold the attitude of oh I have 15 seconds I have sure I have 15 seconds let's let's tackle something let's tidy this up let's I've just had this drink let's put this in the kitchen right away and while I'm at it let's just clean it put it on the drying rack done and the next time in the kitchen I'm next time I'm in the kitchen grab the glass put it away and everything's tidy and it sounds maybe like it would take forever to clean your house this way because it's just 15 seconds but it doesn't actually happen I, I try it I would say try it because I tried it I was skeptical I tried it and it worked so th that is I think the most important part the attitude shift and then the to make it work do the 15 seconds do the 15 seconds make it max a minute when you're doing stuff and just really cut it off there so that you don't get bored and impatient and frustrated you don't want that you want to stay excited and happy that so the 15 second game and then the second one is when you put stuff away when you tidy up, when you come home from a long day and you have a bag with stuff and you empty the bag and put everything where it belongs don't just dump it somewhere in a corner just put it away right away where it's supposed to go and you will see the space around you transform in this, into the most tidy place you've ever been in in less less than a week for me it was a couple of days when I was already like wow wow it's like tidy all the time now <laughs> and it's me doing it <laughs> that's cool it will so just try it See what happens. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. Bye.